Hey guys, welcome back again to Ken Tamplin Vocal Academy. Today we're going to be discussing how to get rid of mucus off of our vocal cords. But before we do that, I think it's really important to ask ourselves one big question. And the question is this. There's an old saying, you are what you eat. So the question is, what do you put into your body? I like to think of my body as like an engine of a car. And if I pour sludge into the engine of my car, I can't expect high performance. So with that said, nutrition plays such a key and pivotal role uh, in staying healthy. And if we have mucus on the cords, more times than not, it's because our body's fighting off an infection or something's just not right. So for feeding our body cheeseburgers and pizza and popcorn and potato chips and Coca-Cola and a bunch of crap, please don't expect your body's immune system to perform at full capacity. So, but with that said, there's a lot of really cool things we can do uh, to countermand that and to also have good immune function, uh, but also some other remedies that can help us get rid of mucus off the cord. So I'm gonna start really quickly with some of my go-tos. Now, I've toured the world for 30 years, and in the 30 years that I've toured, believe it or not, I've only canceled two shows. That's right, you heard me, two shows due to cold and flu. One was a respiratory thing that I had, uh, and another was um, a case of pneumonia that I had. In fact, when I sang uh, one of the videos, um, how to sing like Freddie Mercury, I actually sang that video when I had pneumonia, believe it or not. You can even hear the congestion because I used to have uh, post-nasal drip or a sinusitis. And uh, that's another uh, thing that can cause mucus on the cords is post-nasal drip. So maybe if we get time, we'll talk about that. But first and foremost, uh, what my go-tos are for myself is nutrition. I, I really subscribe to a book by um, a guy named Dr. Furman. It's called Eat to Live. Now this book is predominantly focused on people losing weight. I'll put it on the screen so you can see it, but it's really focused on super nutrition. So uh, don't know that you can follow it to the letter of the law, but I'll tell you what, man, if you can follow some of what this book has to say as far as nutrition, uh, you're gonna be in the 80 percentile or 85 percentile bracket of people that can keep and maintain good vocal health and to remove mucus from the cords. So, and mucus from all over, sinus infections and whatever. Now, uh, in addition then to that, once we've established good dietary practice, practices. Uh, one of the things that I do for colds, now colds and flu are two different things, but one of the things I do for colds is just simply take zinc lozenges. You do a zinc lozenge, um, you can do it every couple hours, five up to five times a day, and uh, you can do it up to five to six days for the week. Now you want to stop after that because it, it can actually um, tear down immune function if you do it too long, but it's an extraordinary uh, way that the minute you start to feel a cold or flu, suck on a zinc lozenge and chances are you won't get it at all and if you do, it'll be cut in half or less than half and then the total duration of the cold itself will also be shortened. So instead of having a cold for four or five days or something, you'll get it for a day, maybe two at best, at most. Um, now you've, you've seen other things like emergency and stuff like that. It also has zinc in it. So there's some cool stuff out there that's like that. Um, something else that I do uh, that is just absolutely awesome. It's fairly new. Uh, it's called liposomal vitamin C. This stuff is rock star good. And what it is, is it actually has an absorption rate I think of over a thousand times that of a buffered or ascorbic acid and or um, like rose hips or something like that, regular vitamin C, a chewable vitamin C, over a thousand times absorption rate because they ha has the molecules are a lot smaller so it can absorb and, uh, and uh, be retained into the body much better. Something else that I do, and I love this stuff, it's called Danielle Ladon's Grapeseed Extract Spray. It's called Antiviral Fungal Fighter. And this stuff is really cool. You spray it under the tongue. You, all, you can also do this every hour or every 20 minutes. I mean, it's grapeseed extract. It's not gonna hurt you. Uh, but if it's bitter under the tongue, it lets you know you have an infection. And when it stops being bitter, you'll start noticing that you know, your, your cold or flu has gone away. This stuff is absolutely awesome. Uh, something else that's really, really good, <laughs> it's kind of a funny name, but this company here, it's called a Wish Garden. Uh, this is a guy who's very anal about stuff that he makes. It's called Kick Ass Biotic. <laughs> True story, that's the name. I'll show you on the screen. And he has a great line of products, a product called Get Over It and some other stuff. Anyway, he makes some really great, healthy, organic stuff that includes echinacea and golden seal. Um, if you can't get this, which you can get all this stuff online. By the way, I have no vested interest in any of this stuff. I don't own stock in any of these companies, nothing. It's just these are things I know for a fact that work and it worked well for me to keep me healthy, especially on the road, you know, with um, uh, bad sleep, sometimes bad food, uh, time changes, weather changes in and out of cold air conditioning, hot conditions, so forth dryness. Uh, but anyway, Echinacea and Golden Seal by Zan. This stuff is awesome too. I highly recommend it. So you can either go with the Kick-Ass Biotic or you can go with this. They're both really good. Now I want to talk about biotics because a lot of people have taken a lot of antibiotics and I'm going to take a little side note here before I get into flus. 
Um, but, but because of that, uh, we have lost a lot of the lactoprova, of the cool hairs that, that grab good bacteria from our stomach. Uh, and we're, um, we're really deficient in being able to retain uh, this good, uh, these good uh, bacteria. So with that said, um, I strongly recommend getting a good probiotic. Try to get the good refrigeratable ones. And guys, I know some of this stuff kind of is a little expensive. I think this is like 50 bucks and it's like a two month supply. But how much are you gonna spend on antibiotics at the doctor's office or going to a hospital visit? I promise you'll spend a lot more than that just in, the, in synthetic things that actually don't make you well but barely put a Band-Aid on things. So, or prolong uh, situations at best. Something else um, I like to do is oil of oregano. This stuff is really good too um, with, for colds and helps clear off some of the mucus on the cords. So getting back to echinacea and golden seal or, or the kick-ass biotic, you spray it in the back of the throat and you like elderberry and some other things that are in there, you just let it come, just gently go down the throat and it's super awesome. Something else that's excellent, 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 I'll put it on the screen is perio wash. Now, a lot of us have heard of you know gargling with Listerine, for example. That's like gargling with kerosene. You, if you swallow that stuff, it even says it on the jar. It says, rush to the hospital immediately you know, from swallowing this stuff. Don't swallow it. Perio Wash is 100% natural, all organic, exceptional. You can gargle with that. It works so good. It's so soothing, especially for sore throats. And, and again, like I said, mucus on the cords or a lot of gack, a lot of gack in the throat. Uh, for, for flu, something that's excellent is colloidal silver. This stuff rules, and why? Uh, get the 1,100 parts per million or 1,000 parts per million, try to get up there, a whole dropper full, once a day, three, four, five days, the minute you start to feel a little bit of fever or chills or something coming on, use this stuff. It will absolutely knock out flu, boom, flat on its back, which is super awesome. Something else that's really, really cool, nature has its own antibiotic, and it's just simply called garlic. You can take raw garlic, you can chop it up, put it on a piece of toast, not too much, a clove or two, boom, eat it, give it the same respect you would as an antibiotic and it will absolutely rock your world and help you overcome a cold and a flu, both. It works for both actually. Something else that's really cool is just ginger, man. Cut off a little sprig of ginger, chop it up in some green tea or some tea and, and slowly sip this. Ginger is excellent, very excellent for cold and flu and also getting rid of inflammation and gack on the cords. Also guys, it's, it's helpful to take just a good uh, multivitamin, you know, because we're not getting a lot of nutrition in our food and stuff. So uh, a good multivitamin just you know, once a day or twice a day or whatever the prescribed thing is, absolutely awesome. Speaking of something that we don't get a lot every day as well is vitamin D3. This stuff is also excellent and almost all of us are deficient in D3. So I highly recommend this. And I know it sounds like a lot of stuff, but in the wake of what I'm talking about, it really, really isn't. Something else that I also highly recommend is uh, omega-3, omega-3 oils. This stuff will help with brain function and all kinds of good stuff and it's just something, it's an absolute necessity in our diets. Uh, I actually happen to like uh, the cod liver oil, the lemon flavored, um, forget what the name of Carlson's I believe it's called, I'll put that on the screen too. And then um, I'm gonna talk about a couple more things but lastly for, about this subject, this is incredible. This sucker right here is awesome. So this company called My Pure Mist, I'll post this on the screen too, uh, has made a humidifier that is literally hospital grade and it's self-cleaning. This thing totally rocks. They even have eucalyptus tabs you can put here uh, in, the, in the humidifier and you just put it on, they even have it with a strap. You just do it maybe two minutes, three minutes a day, a couple, three times a day, totally clears out the sinuses, totally clears out the crap on the cords. Absolutely awesome, guys. So uh, with that said, um, I hope this was helpful for you. I'm gonna post all this stuff on the screen so you can see where to get it. Uh, go online and just research this stuff. And uh, until next time, thank you for joining me, Ben Temple Vocal Academy. Yeah.